Oh, hey, sweetheart. Sorry I wasn't able to go on the date. I'm a little bit, you know, sick. <laughs> yeah. I know it's very silly to <clears throat> be sick on the, you know, the start of a uh, summer. But yeah, I'm a stupid guy. So stupid things happen to me. I don't even know how this happened. It makes no sense. I have not been sick all of winter. And then today happens and then bam, I'm sick. And this isn't a nice illness either. It's very, very bad. I know it sounds weird. I have to talk like this because my throat feels like knives went through them. You know, when you eat chips and then one of them just slices your throat. That's how it, that's how it feels. <laughs> Forgive me for that. So, here's what I wanted to say. We won't be able to go on a date. But, but, because I love you this much, I decided to propose to you a little idea. Instead of going, uh, you know, outside, where I can't go, I will take a nice eight hour out of my uh, daily uh, laying in bed, uh, shivering and hallucinating because I have a fever. And instead, we go, <clears throat> we get pizza, your favorite one, your favorite pizza. And we lay in bed and we watch a movie. Now I know what you're going to say. You don't want to catch my germs. I get that. I understand. But maybe I can sit in the chair. <laughs> I really... I just want to spend some time with you, and I know that we can, <clears throat> but I just really want to. It really sucks, as I was looking forward to our day together. I was looking forward to, you know, seeing each other every day, and sharing stuff together, and talking about whatever... And, I mean, we could lay in bed and watch, like, The Notebook or Inter Interstellar. But, I know it's not as fun as going to the cinema. Going to watch a movie hits so hard. Because they have, like, those big, big comfy chairs. And they rock. I love those chairs. Also, when they when they you get popcorn there, it always tastes better than homemade popcorn. Also, they're big drinks. I love big soda. I know it's bad for me, but God, do I love big soda. So I know it's not as fun, and I know pizza cannot make up for popcorn. That is a very well-known scientific fact. One pizza will never equal one popcorn, but, but, it's still nice. And I no longer feel sick. I'm no longer stuck in bed. So I actually want to see you. You're very far away for me now, for good reasons. I am sick, but... 
I think in like maybe two days I won't be sick anymore and then and then we can do something together I don't think we'll be able to go do something fun anytime soon I mean there's no good movies right now or maybe we could go watch a sh bad movie I mean bad movies are fun bad movies are very fun uh I remember watching this one stupid movie and I went in and it was just empty. No one was there, it was just me. I feel like if we play our cards right, we could have something like that. A big, dark, empty room just for us. And then we get chips or we bring in cereal and milk, like in the box. And then we just pour the milk in the box and we just eat like that out of the out of the box with a ladle. Now that that is actually the best thing that could happen to us, in my opinion, <laughs> in this situation. I'm sorry I ruined everything. I know we had to do many things together. I was happy to see you again. I don't know why life keeps messing with me, keeps just destroying everything. And I know I've not been the best recently. I've been a pretty lousy boyfriend actually but what I can say is when I say things like uh, you know I love you that's that's a that's real that's gen genuine that's it's not much, but it's everything I can offer you. And uh, when I'm no longer, you know, sick, I want us to spend as much time together as we can. I want to watch movies with you, travel with you, read books with you, <laughs> because what I love is not, you know, doing things, it's doing things with you, honestly, we could take a plane and go to a random part of this country and I'd probably enjoy every second of it because you are with me you're just that special to me and I would do anything anything to spend one more minute with you so this illness this is a nightmare for me because be because of this, I wasn't able to see you. I wasn't able to do something I was really looking forward to. And I hope you can forgive me for this. I know it's not my fault that I'm sick. But it still sucks to not be able to do something with the person you love. Even if it isn't your fault. That's all I have to say about it. <laughs> but 
but once I get better, then we will be doing a lot of things together. Promise. I promise.